hi guys welcome back to my channel so today's video is a makeup tutorial video i actually lost some videos so it started from where i was moisturizing her face so the product i use is neutrogena hydro boost gel that is what i used to moisturize her face so after moisturizing her face i wanted to make sure everything is properly set then I used the Mario Badescu Skincare Facial Spray with Aloe, Herbs and Rose Water to spray her face. That was the toner I used in this part. After using that product, I used Makeup Fix Spray to hold all the products I have already applied on her face. So after everything, then we move on to the primer. She is naturally oily skin type, so I mix two primers that suit her skin type. It's very necessary for you to know the type of primer that suits your client. So it's not all primers that are good for a particular skin type. So you need to know and apply the right one on each person. So that's exactly what we did in this particular video. So moving on. We use a color corrector under her eye to avoid dark circles. The foundation we used in this video is Beauty by AD. We actually mixed um, two shades. Yeah, we mixed two shades and I would link it below the video. So after blending the foundation, we went on to contour her face. And then we applied the blush to to make sure we get the right structure we're trying to get her like a snatched cheekbone that was the goal and to give her like a blushy mm, i'm feeling in love type of vibe so yeah so she wants a blush but not too pronounced but but pronounced as well so that's exactly what we were trying to achieve here so we made sure that we blended the whole process for a uniform look so that's exactly what we did so you can see how i'm contouring her cheekbone pushing it up to make sure we get a smashed cheekbone so we are contouring her face here so I use my contour under the darker shade to make sure that it is really snatched. So that's what we're doing here. Blend, blend, blend. So we actually lost some videos here. So we contoured the nose and then applied certain powder on her face. So the certain powder we used here was Airspawn and Laura. Messier. I mixed the two together and that's what I used for this particular setting. Yeah, so moving on to her eye shadow. That's what we're doing here. So I use concealer to conceal her eye. I'm prepping her eye for the eyeshadow. Moving on to the eyeshadow, I use the Beckham's Ageless palettes that's what i use for her eyeshadow as you can see i really use this eyeshadow because it's really gorgeous and it's it's big so i can get enough colors for, for this particular video we used this particular one So, you have to pick your brushes carefully, know the right brushes to use when doing the eyeshadow. So, we are done. So, moving on to the eyebrows, we make sure that we don't overdo it, just keep it simple. And I picked my brush to draw the outer layer and then continue with the fill ins. So, you, with the fill in, you make sure you don't take too much. You just fill in gradually so that it looks more like a natural 
white brows so I concealed it with my Maybelline concealer it really looks nice and natural when you use it so moving on to the eyeliner I lined her eye first before I applied her eyelashes so make sure to draw it carefully so it doesn't stain or go overboard So in this section, I use the Tahila Cosmetics, the Deluxe Edition, the blush and highlights, face, whatever. <laughs> yeah, that's what I use to highlight her eye corner. And this particular one is so beautiful. It's one of my, my favorite brands. It's actually a Nigerian brand. So you guys can check it out. Yeah, so that's what we did. And then I was doing a few touch-ups. And that's what I used in highlighting her nose bridge. It's so gorgeous. But I actually used another highlighter. I, don't, I, I forgot the name. But that's what I mixed. I mixed two highlighters and then that's why it's for her cheeks. So moving on to her lip. So I took my concealer, the Maybelline, the dark one. I won't say dark, dark. I just didn't check the shade and then I use it for her lips their upper and the, and the down just to give it that natural brown color because i didn't want to use a pencil because it appears a bit sharp because she's light skinned and then we picked the baby pink and i mixed it a little bit with the nude to give us this shade and it turned out so so gorgeous so I use the brush to blend the ends to make sure it looked so gorgeous so the lip gloss I used I've forgotten the name but I used their their hot choco it was so so beautiful and I used their baby pink and that's what I used to achieve this look I actually use the all night makeup setting spray to set her face and i just wanted to make sure that everything was perfect so this is our final look and she looks so gorgeous she really really loved her look she really liked her look and all she was saying is you guys should like subscribe and comment on this video so this is actually the end of today's video thank you for watching if you've watched to this point thank you very much see you in my next video bye